Hello everyone, so welcome again. In this video, I am going to show you a very beautiful painting of Lakshmi Narayan with acrylic colors. But don't worry if you don't have acrylic colors, you can also use poster colors or water colors. Okay, so follow the steps. So the first color that I am using is ultramarine blue. Keep a bowl of water in front of you. As you know that acrylic colors dries very fast. To avoid the brush strokes and to avoid the brush marks, you need water at regular intervals. And if you do, do so, then please go and watch this video. Link is in the description box. So the first color that I am using is ultramarine blue or cobalt blue hue. Use the same color for painting his whole body that is ultramarine blue. So you have to use ultramarine blue for painting his whole body. Use little more water for painting his face. Now I am using light green color but if you don't have light green color then you can also use deep green color or any green color other than except a sap green you can use any green. So I am using light green color here. To paint his dhoti, I am using medium yellow color, but if you don't have medium yellow, then you can use deep yellow color also. To avoid brush marks, use water at regular intervals. Now again I am using light green color. Try to use number 0 or number 1 or number 2 round brush as you know that the area here is very very small. So try to use any round brush of number 0 or 1. This is deep red but if you don't have deep red then you can also use primary red or any other red. But I am using deep red. For coloring the garland, I am using orange color and white color. Garland means mala. So now I am using white color with very very less water and orange also with very very less water. To color his weapons, I am using yellow ochre color. So for coloring the, his mace, I am using yellow ochre color. Paint the crown too with yellow ochre color. So now this is lemon yellow color for the decoratives. I am giving a touch of lemon yellow on the garland also. To paint his ornaments, I am using deep yellow color, sorry medium yellow color. You can also use yellow ochre color. So now I am using burn sienna color or the brown color. So follow the same steps as shown in the video. Make small small dots with burn sienna color. Now I am using black pen to highlight his fingers. 
if you don't have black pen then you can use black paint also but so now i'm using black color pencil for some shading but if you don't have black color pencil then you can also use black acrylic color with very very less water and with very very less paint Follow the same steps as shown in the video and if you have any queries related to this video then you can drop a comment in the comment section I will surely reply your answers. Sorry questions. For painting his hairs, I am using black acrylic color. If your black acrylic color is not that much darker, then do a first layer with burnt sienna color and then with black color. In case your black color is not that much darker, but if your black color is darker like me, then don't do this. So now I am using white acrylic color. Decorate his dupatta with white acrylic color. Make small small dots on the dupatta with white acrylic color. This is primary red. So now it's turn for Goddess Lakshmi. So, so the first color that I am using is flesh tint color. That is face color. Paint her neck as well as her hands with the same color that is flesh tint. So now I am using a black pen to highlight his ornaments. So follow the same steps as shown in the video. So now I am painting his peacock feather. First I am using burnt cyanide color, then ultramarine blue and then light green. So first I used burnt cyanide and then ultramarine in the middle. And then I'm, the current color that I am using is light green color. So follow the same steps. Now I am using a red pen. So make the similar patterns as shown in the video with red pen. If you don't have red pen then you can also use red paint color. That is red acrylic color. Matlab primary red color. This is brown color pencil for shading. Now I am using light green color. You can use any green color but not sap green. Other than except sap green you can use any green paint. So now I am using light green color. To paint her ornaments, I am using yellow ochre color. This is lemon yellow color. To paint her sari, Use very less amount of water as we don't want any transparency effect. The same process we did in Lord Vishnu's Dhoti. So this is deep red but if you don't have deep red you can also use primary red or any other red. But I will prefer to use deep red but if you don't have deep red don't worry you use primary red. So now I am painting the owl with grey color. To make grey color take white color and then take very small amount of black color and then mix them after mixing them you will get a color that is gray color so follow the same steps so i'm using black color pencil to highlight and to make the feathers of this owl
so now i'm using a red pen for the decorations on her sari but if you don't have a red pen you can also use anything in red for coloring her hairs i'm using black acrylic color now it's turn for white Oh my god, what's wrong with this crow? Jab main bolna shuru karo, toh hi start ho ja raha hai. So decorate her hair with white paint. So this is lemon yellow for the ornaments of owl. And, and this is the last part of this drawing. So I hope you must have enjoyed the video. So let's meet in next video.